Basically, they lacking. Bonafide businessman, religion don't define him better than his decisions can. Prodigal profit ain't worth half the price. Purchase paid for after death, it's the afterlife. My future, I'm just preparing for my future life. Cause my mama say ain't living right. So just in case I ain't living this one right, I'll be riding with no sinners like. Cause I'll be out to get it. I can see me with it, I ain't worried about you niggas I'm just lining up in digits, I get it how I live it On my mama mama, I ain't seen, uh, I saw a very small clip I don't know what cuz went on there talking about But I see Buck Jenner went on a, must be a pretty popular podcast called Big Facts I just find that ironic, because I did see like a whole like 20 minute video, cook up boss did. Shout out to the low, cub low on Crip. I seen cuz cook like now. Look, oh, blah, 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 blah. first time you hear the name cook up boss down south, down south, artist, street nigga. You thinking cooking up, whipping up in the kitchen, but this nigga cook buck jitter ass. So, my mama, mama, cuz it's like when your city tell a story from familiarity. It's a queer though running around on the internet right now saying shit about me. Cuz called me a rat, right? Then he doing the interview and they like, he like, oh, spot a little, yeah, he a snitch. I got this paperwork right here in my house. I just gotta find it. It's gonna be an eternity on oh, my mama mama for anybody ever show you anything like that. Never happened. But from Starlito to Cook Up Boss to a lot of, lot of like, hey, <laughs> shout out to my. <laughs> Hey, oh my baba baba to a lot of niggas in casual I ain't even like whoop. Cuz got a reputation. Bring us back to the word of the day, which was reputation. That's hard for him to say. Do y'all know what he went on this podcast and said? All I know, Cooker Boss was telling me, uh, <laughs> you lying, David. And it ain't just Greg. Cuz was talking about being in the mall in Atlanta <clears throat> with Buck. And then, like, you know, someone like Greg, for those that know, know. You know, it's getting real tricky even talking about them kind of people these days. On my mama, mama, we living in a cold scenario. This is crazy. Oh, my mama, mama. Y'all know what babies are? Wait till we get on that real quick. Let me not get off this stuff. Because like, he was in the mall with Buck. Uh, and one of the people like Greg ran up on him and like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Cook up bosses like, Cuz tried to play it off like it was a fan. He tried to play it off. He tried like it was a fan. Like, like whoa, whoa, whoa. And he was like, no. That was his people. He was like. He say Buck Jenner was so skinny analyst on how like how he gave a cold shoulder to his peoples in the mall. His peoples turned around and got in uh cook up boss DM and was like, nah, he trying to play like that. It's really like this. Whoop wop wop put me in the light. So cook up boss is like telling David, he better quit lying or I'm gonna give this these people some of the sun. Cub really said something that matter when Cub say. He got a call from Tasha K that, uh, and she won an interview uh, on the subject. Now, I'm going to salute the cuz if he can turn that one down cuz, you know what I'm saying? He probably ain't going to feel comfortable hollering at her just based on the way she get down. And he know that's just like a wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. And, and, I, I mean, you know, I don't know, cuz like he he do his stuff and since you dig lies, but if cuz gonna Tasha K talking about what he talking about, cuz ooh wait, and then like <laughs> I did say we wasn't gonna laugh at Buck Jenner. Cause I'm not laughing at Buck Jenner right now. I'm laughing at Cook Up Boss because the, the way he laughed at Buck Jenner, he just you know Cuz got some comedy to his get down, and it was kind of feeding how he put it together just to. You know what I'm saying? I really hope uh, Buck getting some help. Just look. it. He looked just like Lil Nas X. <laughs> mama, mama, God. It got to be killing him how 
cuz is embracing his demons and then he making his demons chase him and like and, and, and Lil Nas is just blowing up. Takuchi grabbed the rainbow, blew up. And then uh Jenner, Buck, and X Nas. They got they the same type cuz like you know, same guy, like stunt double. Oh my bubble bubble. He don't want a bubble. He just want trouble. Uh, I, 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 I would cook up boss of food. Y'all got to go check out the little uh, video he did on it. Cause on my mama, mama, something got to give. We gonna learn sooner or later. If I was cut, I would just stay out the public. Y'all know what babies are? Babies are children. Uh, dictated by their parents that are born. And no matter what genitalia they're born with, their parents decide for them at birth. This is not a boy or a girl. And the concept is to let them be raised up until the age of around four. And I don't know why four is this magical number, but this is what um, I heard stated in, a, in an official report on the subject about babies and not babies they raise raising stabies and at the age of around four they want to have children their children it seems like a plot and plan that they want to try to push on children to at the age of four they can make then a decision on whether they feel like desire to be or actually boy girl or I've even heard in India and I think it was another country that they've actually established an official third gender it's crazy out here y'all what does it all mean you dig a lies I know it's not exactly what it appears to be but I have learned in my studies that uh, emasculation of a nation always precedes the fall of that nation. So many times in history, this is not something that I'm making up, not trying to sound smart. Y'all y'all would have known if I been knew that, I probably would have been said that speaking on these subjects. But I've learned recently that throughout history, every time a nation from Babylon to Sodom and Gomorrah, which is, you know, don't want nobody to look at me as if I'm establishing Sodom and Gomorrah as an actual factual existing realm but even if it's, there's an allegory attached to the concept the story states um, you know King Solomon you know once he began to be you gotta just be careful it's no wonder just think about it the, the, the main threat to us as a country as far as the superpower from my understanding, and I have a very slight understanding of politics, is, is and has been China for quite some time. And right now, while uh, I see our society moving in one direction, China is passing laws about mandatory masculinity for men. <laughs> Gotta read between the lines on my mama mama. <laughs> up in court, had to fight a couple of cases, practice don't kill when you come in them places, it be written on they faces, Where motherfuckers is racist, fuck trial, shit tricky, give me the deal, I ain't never seen a real killer be the pill, shooter got him by the future if he got a date, behind the gate, lot of politics to tolerate, sitting in the car, finna spit a cigar, to my niggas on the yard, send my biggest regards, he don't wanna run it back, we already ran it, he had the fat on his back, cause I'm heavy handed, Catch another fame, we can follow up. But I ain't waiting all day, nigga. Squabble up. Gang of anger, got it all bottled up. Gang bangers, whole world follow us. Evil signs you believe, can you see?
see the sun Tell me who gon' lead the blind, why they lead the blind Am I wrong, cause I'm all about me and mine Niggas better catch on, read between the lines Evil times you believe, can you see the sun Tell me who gon' lead the blind, why they lead the blind Am I wrong, cause I'm all about me and mine Niggas better catch on, read between the lines Niggas, niggas clowns need to be in the circus Put these buzzers on the turf, they defeating the purpose The first to return when the enemy serves Immediately on ease, these weenies be nerve Dedicated to a section that didn't deserve us It turned us into murderers and then the deserters Number one lesson I learned in the bin When you lose your respect, you can't earn it again Smoke a lot, classified most faded The love won't be satisfied to all his folks who made it This cabbage patch where he caught most of the damage at Perhaps he know a magic plastic the surgeon that can manage that Ask me, I'm just a product of my habitat Narcotic habits where they quick to let you have that Hey, you don't be talking about he need half that I'm laughing at him as if my little bad is having that Who gon' you believe, can you see the sun? Tell me who gon' lead the blind, why they lead the blind? Am I wrong, cause I'm all about me and mine? Niggas better catch on, read between the lines Who gon' times you believe, can you see the sun? Tell me who gon' lead the blind, why they lead the blind? Am I wrong, cause I'm all about me and mine? Niggas better catch on, read between the lines Wasn't that puzzle? Big shout out to my nigga SPR, Spotter Low. You know, I'm in the black box. Had to come through, tap in, show love one time. Yeah, y'all make sure y'all subscribe. Stay tuned. All that.